What did you see? Oh, oh wait, he's a door stopper, oh, dude. Look at him. Door, is he picking his nose? two for the day. I am with my friend Carrie here. Hi everybody. Who uh, we just have a lot of fun when we go mm -hmm. in and do this together. Now as I said in the last video I really 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 and I know you guys hear me say this a lot but I really do need to get more disciplined and leave things on the shelf that are not going to result in at least a $20 sale. And now that is predicated on it being at a price where $20 is at least triple uh, my profit. So if it's, let's say if it's like $7 and it needs to be, well, seven is like borderline. If it's like $10, then it needs to be worth about 30. So that's kind of how I'm basing it. Because there are fees, there are things, there are costs associated with selling this stuff. So you can't buy it for 10 and sell it for 15 and make any money. You just can't, you're not making $5 because there's a whole slew of stuff that goes in. So that's how I have made sure that I can make money and have room to negotiate on price and all that. Anyway, it is late in the day. So they've been running this, uh, the color sale today, right? And we're mm -hmm. uh, blue, blue is our color. We did find a few things at the last store that we got for a dollar. So it's always interesting to see if there's anything left that you can still grab for a dollar when you come late in the day. Let's see what everybody else left behind. Now this is, this is the Goodwill that started it all for me on YouTube. Because <laughs> this is the Goodwill that I got slapped at. So we're gonna be careful not to get into any trouble while we're in here too. So. Well, we'll get in trouble, but not that kind, and I'll be her bodyguard. <laughs> so we're good to go. Nobody's <laughs> slapping today. Not gonna get slapped today. <laughs> well, I might, who knows. Anyway, we're gonna get in there and see what we can find. Open, open, open. Oh my goodness, there's hardly any carts. Where's all the carts? Here, this looks like a lucky cart. We'll take the lucky cart. That's why I'm like, I'm all right. Oh, and the oh. music is not Where's very loud. Oh, this, this guy, is, oh, okay, we'll get back to him, but this guy is like a, I know this maker. I, this is where I need more hands. Like why? They had all this space to put. See, is that a twenty dollar bill though? Is it twenty? No, I'm just a or is it forty nine? Or is it just a happy, happy daughter? Oh my! Hold on. I can't even. You're gonna have to. We're already having out. issues here. You're Hold on, I gotta figure out what this what this says. What does that say? Let me see. Looks like San Francisco Bay trading. Oh, okay. Probably, I don't know, he is bronze. He is bronze, what do you think? I think he's oh. got a full shelf of this. How much is he? He's 8.99. Mm -hmm. So, I, uh, I think I could get 25 for him. I think you could. I think I could. I think you could. It's pretty cool. And we do have 20% off. That's right. We got 20% off, so, okay, I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him for $8.99. Okay, I was just reaching for that cloisonne kitty right there. That's a weird cloisonne though. It's not what I was expecting. Maybe that's not called cloisonne when it's, but it is cloisonne, no, he is cloisonne. Yeah, he is. That's, that's beautiful. That's pretty awesome. Is it a $20 bill? Easy. She says it's an easy 20, Poison so it goes for pretty decent money. I'm He's only a dollar 99 oh, and okay. we're gonna get him. All right. What are you? Who are you? You are oh, it's Stone Bunny Inc. Stone Bunny Inc. is a good brand. Now look, you guys are saying, but that was at Home Goods for $14.99. But yeah, you know what? That doesn't matter. Home Goods yeah. is a clearance area, and once stuff is no longer in the retail stores. People look for this stuff. So how much was he? He's he's six dollars. So can I get twenty dollars for him all day long? 
All right, then let's check this little dude out. Would this would have, I feel like this would have had another piece also. Would it have had a lid too? Let's look at the bottom. It's almost like a, a Yixing pottery, but not quite. I don't know. You know what, that one, I'm gonna leave. But then, what do we have here? Oh my goodness, we have a very large ewer with horses. Oh, it's $12.99. And do we have a name? No name. Nope, nope, nope. Uh -oh. You're one of those bad people. <laughs> You're being naughty. Uh, just without a name, I don't know. See, again, this is a piece that I would have to, in person, because I'm not going to ship this in person, mm -hmm. I would have to be able to get at least $35. And I don't know that I could on this. I probably could. Oh, you know what? That just, that just oh, solved my mind. dilemma. Yeah, I kind of, I like when that happens because then I don't have to wrestle. I don't like to wrestle. Oh, look, look, look. Let's, let's fix them up here. Let's fix them up here. Boop. There you go. Very cute. All nice and together. Well, then let's look at this guy. Oh, look at that. What is that? A D. Just a D. Okay. That's but cool. That's a pretty fantastic glaze. It is. And that feels like a $20 bill to me. Me too. Oh, I thought for a minute he might be fused glass. He is not. Bath and Body Works. Oh, hello. I was talking about, yeah. He looks like the Kleban cat. Or what Kilbin, it's Kleban though, cat. isn't it? He is certified international. Who, may, um, who makes? I just told you who makes. Oh, he's only five bucks? Well, that made the decision easy. Yep, we're getting him. What did you see? Oh, oh he's, he's a door stopper, oh, dude. Look at him. Door, is he picking his nose? No, he's like this. He totally, he totally looks no, like. No, 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 he's. You're defending him. He's being coy. You're defending him. You're being coy. I think he's picking his noise. He's being coy. Noise, his coy. nose. Okay. All right. Like his finger All right. No. Just no. 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 I think he's picking uh -huh. his nose. I'm sticking with it's it. Ten dollars. But he is super cool. He's like a nice door stopper. Except he's picking his nose. <laughs> Love. The use of the old fabric. That's nice. Oh, the toy, toil, toily, toil. Yeah. However you say it. Three dollar. Toily. Just cute. What do we got here? Oh, it's for art. Oh, boy. It's for art. And uh -oh, oh it's this? got the little easily thing that stands up. Oh, what we have I already there? pointed out love. Oh. Where were you? You know, I know a little girl who could definitely use this. This is kind of, it's kind of awesome for her. And it's only seven bucks. I'm picking that up for Rachel. Bye. All right, now what did you find? Owl. You found an owl. Is and I he... wonder if you could put a little light. Fixture. I was wondering, do you put like a light yeah, or something could, in him? Look or... at his tummy. He does look like he's meant to hold some light. Let's see the back. He's three ninety nine. What's he made of? He's like a ceramic. Is he vintage? Clay? I think he is vintage. He seems a little vintagey. And look, here's a little thing for the light. So he's. Like it a is. He is lamp. a lamp. <gasps> Let me mm. see the front of him again. For $3.99, yep, we'll get him. All right, let's see. Let's see what we can find. Send the glassy baby vibe, come on. This is yourself over here, Danny. Ooh, these are kind of cool, did you see these? Kind of the stacked glass. Oh, it's a candle. Yeah, there's Where something kind of cool about those. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's perfect for me, the cougar. That's leopard. All right, whatever. Animal print. <laughs> cougar, all the same. <laughs> oh my goodness. 
Faith, hope, and love. She's kind of cute. Christy Tomlinson Carson. See, this is a thing. I would normally pick this up. But, you know, but I don't think this is a $20 bill. I think this is like 12 to 15 So, look at me. Look at me putting it back. I know I was going there next. Sorry. <laughs> but what, are they coasters? I don't know. I think they're like paperweights. Or paperweights they're with... Heavy. Sandals. Okay, so it's $2 for two of these. And they're pretty cool. I think... Collectively, I definitely can get my $20 out of these. Absolutely. Holy moly, this is the store that just keeps on giving. Let's start right here with some little stacked owls. Now see, $10, I don't think I can get 30 for that. I think I have to leave that. I know some of you are going, what? And these are calling me, but they were only $6.99 and now they're only $3.99. So I think I have to leave that too. Although I do really like these birds. Oh, he's broken. Good. Okay. That made it easier. The monkeys. No, no, I mean, no, oh, wait, who's it's missing? Speak here. See. Oh, the guy's out there seeing some evil right now because <laughs> he's missing. So you, you kind of need the whole set for those to do their thing. My gosh, look at this. It's going to be really hard because... I mean, it's like a devil bunny. Is he? He's a devil bunny, right? Yeah, he looks like he does. He does. He, he looks like a man. devil bunny. Ow! Make me resist. He's only a dollar. Okay, she took it away from me. Three ninety nine on him. Super cute. See, this is hard. This is hard to leave stuff behind. I want him really bad. But is that an Isabel Bloom? Oh, it's got a broken tail. Oh, and it's not an Isabel Bloom. Okay. Phew. You got another little owl back there. No, I'm ignoring the other one because I know it's not. It's not. I need to be disciplined. What about those? Yeah, no, those don't do so great. They came with like bath salts or something. Once upon a time. No, see, I, I, it's hard. It's hard to be good at this. But oh, and then, then there's this. Okay, so here, this is beautiful. Five dollars for this amethyst glass. It's got the actual cork. It's got the ball top. That's beautiful, right there. All right, I am going to pick up this piece. Although maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I, this is one. Maybe I should just leave it behind. But it's a cute little piece of Temptations in yellow. For, you know what? I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. I'm going to be good. See, I see a mushroom bottom right there. Do you see a mushroom bottom? Are you thinking for your... Oh, he's five drafting? bucks though. I can't spend five dollars on a mushroom bottom. Can't do it. Can't do it. You got a soap dish? on the wall soap dish. Oh, it's a, it's a vintage one, too. Yeah. That's actually really cool, and it's only a dollar. All right, what might the... Uh, that's That's got a nice look to it. It's like an egg basket. It is like an egg basket, and I like it, but it's I'm going to leave it. There's a little rag basket. No, we're not going to look at the little rag basket. Okay, well, you guys are probably wondering what it is. What is it? I'm going to show you, but you know what? She wouldn't... She, she poo-pooed my, my egg basket, so I'm poo-pooing her little wire basket there. Come on, come on, look at this, look at, <laughs> oh, he's, he's fantastic. I know you guys are all like, what in the world are you talking about? <laughs> I do, I kind of love him. He's our love, he's love he theme, love. he's love. He, is love. he does, he's got, he's got, he's got some issues, including not having a price, but. What's that big ol' speaking of love? Oh, hey, pull the love from the back of the shelf there. Oh, it's fifteen dollars for that love. So I would have to be able to sell that love. Ooh, love is using my little using my little formula. I would need to get at least, you know, forty to fifty bucks for love. And I'm not sure love is worth 40 to 50 bucks. I, I mean, it should be. 
love should be worth 40 to 50 bucks, but we're gonna leave the love at that price. Okay, we have elephants. What are they? Um, I don't know. It's tin. Yeah. They're like tin punched, but that's very contemporary. And Asian, Asian decor things, that, like the, the Asian collectors, they want super old. Mm -hmm. Otherwise you can't get very much money for it. This stuff will sell, but just not for very much money. Oh, and it came from Ross for $15.99. <laughs> that's my saying. That's me right there. Yes. Oh, no, okay. I'm not going to get it, but that's totally me. I think she's moving. Wait, why are you moving? I got to see what you're moving to. Oh, no, nothing exciting. I see a little pull piggy back there. So, oh, what, look, they're little, oh, mm -hmm. it's a sunflower and they're all little like ACO paintings, like for 99 cents. Okay. I'm getting that. Sorry. All right. I'm, I'm going to dig now. Oh, what's this? Exactly. What is that? Beautiful. I don't know who makes these. That is, it's that faux wood, it's, huh? It's almost like it? a Scirocco wood, isn't it? No, I think. No, no. I don't think it's real wood. Oh, it I think it's that. Scirocco. Oh, it's pretty cool. Gosh darn it! Hmm. It's seven dollars though. Is it worth twenty-one? I think it might be. I, mean, I he's, think he's not even marked, so he's, he's going to be a little bit. The later. fact that it's horses, I think, is what is going to make it. So I'm going to grab that. All right, we're back up on this shelf here because we've got more. Ooh. And they're all 99 cents? Ooh. Ooh. Busy little bee. Oh, I like these. I like these. More, more, more. I want more. Hold on. Ooh, these, okay. I don't know if this is an actual vintage one. Oh wait, here we go, 2016. Nope, yeah. there's an older version of these mm -hmm. back from, what is it, the 80s? That sells for really big money. This is probably just reproducing that. I kind of like this, look at it, look at, look me? at all the Ds. Look yeah, at all the look Ds, at look, at look at, give me a D. Give me a D, give me a D. <laughs> it, I told you it was your shelf. And then there's a little lizard top box. And the construction of this box, is our box basket, is um, it's really good. And it's $2.99, so we're going to pick that up. Check out this pastry board with the, you know what I, I... And then you got to go back to the side. I wonder if that, I wonder if that would sell at the, um, the at yeah. the booth because yeah. that's pretty fantastic that's super cool. that's it's amazing. even it's even got the recipe for plain pastry mm -hmm. how much is it it is 10 oh it's 10 bucks so what do you think so i'd have to be able to get 30 you for it get 30 for this. you think yeah. it's pretty yeah. awesome it's i mean it's a, like a solid piece of wood yeah it's like i just need a person that would not be interested in that sign. <laughs> they would have to be interested in cooking <laughs> or baking. All right, let's get it. We have a duck with doors. Or is it a goose with doors? Oh wait, look. He looks like a duck. He opens up into a little. And look at his little security. He's got doors. like a little hidden compartment. This oh little. Oh my gosh. This little goosey duck guy. He came from TJ Maxx again, though. TJ Maxx is a clearance place. And originally thirty dollars, and they get those originals because that's probably what his original retail was when he was new. But I'm pretty sure I can get twenty dollars for a duck with doors. I'm gonna say twenty-five. Okay, there we go. Let's get him. This store is just loaded with stuff today. Oh, why are you sticky? Oh, he was sticky. Darn it. He probably sat in somebody's kitchen and, oh, he's, he's broken. Ugh, awful cute. Oh, look at the angel kitty. Angel kitty is a Telly M. Stein. These actually do pretty good. He is a little bit, he's a little bit chippy though. What do you think? You're the cat person. This little bird, how much is he? I think he's like five bucks. 
So we'd have to be like a $20 bill. What do you think? I'm borderline on him. I think we'll leave him. We'll leave him. We'll we'll leave him for somebody else. But I need these for one of my little creations. (laughs) Hello, Mr. Fish. He's kind of cool, but at the same time, I don't know. What do you think? I think you need to I will in a moment, but I have to make a decision on the carp. What is his price? First, he is six dollars. You would, I think. Let's look at him very carefully. Okay, while you're looking at him, I'm gonna. Yeah, look at his. This is enough. Oh, she says no. Oh, good. Very good. That always makes the decision easy. All right, let's see. This is a place where I do make some exceptions because mugs sell so easy. Those are kind of cute. Who makes? It is cute. And Island Hula Honeys for 99 cents. I think that one would be an easy sell for 99 cents. Look at that. Big honking. Like, there's no way your coffee would still be warm by the time you got done with that. That's a really nice, it's a nice mug, but you know what? I don't even really need more mugs right now. So unless it's something super special, we are gonna, oh, but that's kind of super special. Mm -hmm. Don't bother me, I'm crabby. That's been my theme this week. Mm -hmm. 99 cents, yeah, I need the crabby mug. (laughs) All right. Oh, okay. We've only got where two. Two's not bad. Um, I'm gonna get this for a friend of mine who does collect navy stuff. Although, ooh, that needs some work. But you know what? I think she won't mind putting a little work into it to have that. I'm just gonna give this to her, and she knows who she is. What are you over there digging out? <gasps> a jellyfish. What's on the other? Is it marked with a place? No. Anything on the bottom? 99 cents. Yep. We'll take, because you know what? When we went to the aquarium, mugs like that were selling for like $25. So, this is Disney Pocahontas. For, how much are you? $2.99? You know what? That's not bad. That's not bad. I think uh, this. While it may not be a $20 bill, it's at least $15. Okay, what are these little guys down here? A vitamin. This one is... Wait a minute. A... I'm trying to figure these out. So there's A vitamins. There's... Which vitamin is this? Oh, vitamin C. Okay, what vitamin is this? Vitamin E. And last but not least, we have vitamin B. (laughs) Look at that. How cute are those? A buck a piece. Gotta get them. You don't find a lot. All right. I usually find some pretty good glasses in this store. And let's see if today follows true. I'd love to find some like this is the store that I found fire and light at. This like this is super cool for football fans. Who is Denver Broncos 62 to 67? It looks like oh that is a that's a cool glass. It looks like somebody put it in the dishwasher though. Unfortunately. But it is cool. But, it is cool. but it's a little faded, so Okay, what else? What else, what else, what else? Oh, what is this? Oh, you know what? Oh, good. I'm glad this one isn't etched the same because I passed up a Kettle One glass at the other store that had the K on the bottom, and I would have been kicking myself if I just found another one to go with it. But I didn't. It's all good. We're good. We can pass it by. Oh, I guess we have to go hit that Christmas, huh? We're dangerous in the Christmas department. That's why <laughs> we have to be careful. Oh my goodness, look at this glass. Oh my goodness. 
she's uh she's something else oh i'm done you oh i thought it was a starbucks it is not a starbucks okay these guys are kind of cute but no danny i know i'm just looking i'm just looking i can look you can you may all right thank you for permission <laughs> What is this? Hanukkah candles. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Actually. <laughs> that wouldn't be bad. And a box of is it cards? Those brand new cards. It is. They are. Does anybody send Christmas cards anymore? I I do. I don't. I'm so bad. Oh, look how cute they are. It's very retro. My goodness. It's a Hobby Lobby thing. But I am going to put right back on the shelf as much as I like them. We're looking for, we're looking for high end. He's got to be older or newer. Is he like paper mache? Yeah, he's paper mache. Oh, he's total paper mache. He's kind of cool, but uh, I don't know. What do you think of that? Ah, uh, I think he's newer though. Do you? I, he doesn't look old. Yeah. Or he's been very well kept. I still don't think he is worth 20 bucks, so you know what? Santa can go right back there. Okay, we found we found the kitsch. <laughs> Who used to do plastic? plastic oh, look, it has got a little box sewn <gasps> into the it. box. Oh, that's kind of awesome. <laughs> made this with love. But I don't know, do we get it? Is it $20 worth? I don't, I, don't, I don't know the price of kids. I just don't think it is. So we're going to put it back. So I just found the Spode sugar jar. And you know it's Spode because it's got the little Santa Claus at the top of the tree. And there it is on the bottom. It is $3.99. So we will pick that up. All right. We got some, some more kitsch to go with the other kitsch. Feels like this should like make music or something, but it doesn't. It just sits there and looks kitschy. <laughs> All right, let's find some good stuff. I don't. I think their Christmas is getting a little picked over. I don't think there's a lot of new Christmas coming out, so the Christmas tends to get a little picked over by this time because it's been out for a while now. That would have probably had a very nice uh, ornament in it. That is now no longer in it. Because that's what happens. Oh, I bought a whole, a whole pile of these things. And I don't need any more. But the gift of Christmas, that just looks adorable. Oh, I was looking to see if it was signed by the artist. It's not. It was signed to like someone as a gift. Is that the sweetest thing? Oh, so cute. All right. That's kind of adorable too. <laughs> kind of cute. We're gonna leave it. All right, one more Christmas shelf to go. I do kind of like this Santa Claus. Um, he was only $2.97 to start with. But that is the sweetest Santa I think I've ever seen. I really kind of like him. I, I think I need to have, I don't know how much he is. I can't imagine he's much. I want that for me. All right, I think, I think that's it. Got a little lusterware. It's one saucer and two teacups. Yeah. Definitely not a $20 bill. This is not, look at, this is not depression glass. This is repro, repro depression glass. What do we got here? It is cute. Oh, El Foitan, handmade in Spain. That, I like the color. I think that could be a $20 bill. And it is $2.99. We're gonna grab that. You have permission. All right. Ooh, look at the dragon plates. Ooh. 
Oh, these are these are actually vintage made in Japan sticker. I got to pull the cards in. These are I think this one's 3.99 and then it's 5.99 for a set of 4. I think we're going to grab those. All right. Cute. Are you a rebel without a cause? I think you have a cause. I'm just saying. Cause trouble. There you go. That's a cute. That's a cute dish. Hobbyist piece. All right. I think we did. I think we did good with our dragon dishes. Those are amazing. Yeah. I found some good dishes here. This is my. Like I said, this is my fire and light store. So they get some good stuff. I will do that. I still have some plates. <laughs> what? What in the world do we have going on here? Oh, so that sits on its head. Well, that's kind of stinking cute. Um, he's like a little, like a robot. Is he a robot or is he like a butler? Or is he a mouse? Oh wait, he's a dog. Wait, he's a dog. He's a dog, okay. I gotta get him. What are these? What are these? What are these? Oh my God. I thought it was a vase at first. You got that? What is it? I don't even. Tequila. These are tequila bottles. Oh, they're tequila bottles? What? I guess. Okay. Yes. All right. That's kind of cool. They are, but don't need them. Okay. I don't even. I don't even get this because this is like like you can still go buy this wine. There's nothing special about this bottle so i don't get it i don't get it but what do i know oh my gosh, look at this. this is kind of interesting garden essence herb and irma what did you they find like little posters of oh bars of pubs in england they are drunken duck oh jack the oh how much are those five dollars i think we'll, i think we need those uh, those are kind of fantastic. Right? Yeah, let's get those. Okay. I just pulled this off the shelf and I have a whole bunch of Pampered Chef stuff to sell. This is sealed still. Brand spanking new. Six bucks. Look at, look at this cool chicken. I don't know if he's, he doesn't look like he would have a lid. He looks like he's maybe meant to be a utensil. I think he is. Yeah. He's kind of cool. Okay, this is one of those borderline. It's five dollars. Five. He's five. I think I could get twenty bucks for the chicken. I think I could. I think I could. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna give it a shot. Then, as I'm down peeking under here, I spot it. I think this is Pioneer Woman. It sure is. Three ninety nine Pioneer Woman butter dish. Yes, please. We got canisters. All right, nothing else. Oh wait, what are those bowls? Ooh, look at those. Those are, those are some pottery. I can't read, I need your hands. <laughs> we gotta see who done those. They are, oh, they're made by microwave safe, dishwasher safe, <laughs> made in China. There you go. No, we don't know who makes them, but they are pretty cool, but yeah. We're gonna pass on them. These little guys are cute. Little, are those ramekins? Is that what those are? Oh, I get a point. It's a covered. Look at, That's cute. it's kind of interesting. It's it's hand painted. It's kind of a nice piece. Nice piece. Ooh, goodness gracious, look at here. Hello, $5.99. Made in Tunisia. Just give it to me. Just give it. It's going in the cart. It's going in the cart. It's so pretty. All right, check out this bottle. Yeah, it's like genie bottle shaped, but it's clear, you know. It's kind of cool. It's got the cork. It's got the round top. How much is it? Five bucks. What do you think about that? Bottle? I'm thinking that's an easy 20 bucks. I'm going to grab that. I know I'm buying a lot of big stuff, but I am starting that new space where, you know, I can do the big stuff, 
Who makes that? That is made by, does that say Shenandoah? Garden City Pottery, made in USA. That's an oldie. It's a very nice looking oldie. Nope, I'm not shipping this, but I can sell this in person for 20 bucks. All right, we're doing a little too good at this Goodwill. I did not want to find this much stuff. I really didn't. Look at, oh, let me move this over because this is one of those things. Jordan loves these things. Yeah. And just so everyone knows, in Florida, I made her leave behind that ivy canister, and you know what? I bought her one, so she got her ivy canister. All right, a little gander through the lamps. What is it with all the owl lamps I'm finding lately? Yeah, he's only five bucks. I can ship him. He just takes one of those little candle type. He's a nice little like nightlight type owl. I'll get him. Okay. We got like a 70s <laughs> petal lamp. It's $12? Yeah. Uh, I think we should get it. I think so. Too. That's a good one. Look. Look at that. I love that acorn lamp. Hard to say how old it is. I'm not sure if it's vintage. It is, you know, it's a JQ. I kind of love it. It's even got the little finial. Look, it's got the little little pine cone finial. How much is it? How much is it? It's $12.99. Oh, bummer. Bummer, bummer, bummer. All right, I'm super bummed out about the pine cone. Look at the little palm tree lamps. Those are cute too. Ooh, and the little glass lamp. They got some cute stuff in this store today. I'm oh, look at those green glass lamps. Those are pretty awesome too. Dang, look at the double. Okay, I don't need any more lamps though. This is an issue. I'm walking away. I am walking away, I'm walking away. Let's see if there's any pillows. All right, oh, what's uh, that? That's, uh, oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. he's an outdoor pillow. He's a toucan. He is $5 and he is coming home with me. I just pulled this off the shelf, but sadly, they want $15. So we have to leave Mickey and Minnie behind. All right, the fringe caught my eye and it is Victoria's Secret and it is only $6.99. So I'm gonna grab that bag. What did you find now? This is a cute guy. Look at that, is the mirror's not broken? No, it's not. Ooh, how much is he? Here. He's a blue tag, he's $1. $1. See the front again? Yeah, that's pretty cool, I love it. We tried really hard to put the zebra back together, but there's just something missing on the front. Those three pieces go, but there's just something wrong up there. I don't know. Poor zebra. But found me a Snoopy. This is just like, it's so funny. Pretty classic Snoopy, and yet it's so appropriate for the uh, day we live in. $3.99 from Hallmark. I'm gonna grab the Snoopy. All right, this is one of two carts. Carrie's got the other cart. <laughs> there it is. There's the other cart. So we could have fit it all in one cart, but we decided to like go gentle this time. So now we're gonna go check out.
Goodwill is maddening. I, I, you know, when you go to all the Goodwills, you see the difference in how Goodwills are run. So I'm checking out. I've got two carts full of stuff. I'm spending, you know, close to a couple hundred bucks. And the woman is irritated because I have too many things on the counter. And I got Carrie over here. She's, you know, we... <laughs> Fortunately, Carrie was smart enough to grab newspaper from the Goodwill we just came from. Genius. Just in case. And uh, they had no boxes, no paper. Okay, that's fine. But then the woman was getting irritated that I didn't want her to put my breakable items just into a bag. Like she was not just a little irritated, she was like really irritated. And then at the end, the little spode sugar bowl. I did not notice that the lid was entirely cracked. And I didn't stop her fast enough from ringing it up. So she had to call a manager over to take it off. But I had that little Santa Claus. And she says, how about I just swap it and just charge you, you know, the, and I'm like, yeah, no, he's not, he's not a $3.99. He was only $2.97 new. The price was still on the bottom. So then she was irritated at me for that, calls the manager over, and the manager says, I can sell it to you for $1.99. And I said, but it was only $2.97 brand new. I said, how about 99 cents? And she just, she didn't flinch her face. She goes, I can sell it to you for $1.99. This is a customer who's spending $200. I, I just, I don't understand, but I understand now why things happened at this Goodwill once before a little over a year ago because they just don't run things well at this Goodwill. And I'm not even going to give you the location. If you know, you know. If you don't, I'm not, I'm not going to call them out. You'll experience it yourself if you come here. But I probably will not come back to this Goodwill because of that. There's too many good Goodwills. Good Goodwills. Mm -hmm. like, the, like my Centennial Goodwill, fabulous love them the manager knows me knows how much money not that I want special treatment because I spend a lot of money I don't want special treatment I want them to treat every customer the way they treat me and I can almost guarantee you they do I can attest to that there yeah because I bought some amazing um, macrame curtains and she put she's like I'm gonna give you the best deal ever $8.99 for a pair of macrame curtains that are going to be able to go for at least a hundred dollars yeah. yeah because that manager knows it's all about getting the stuff moved because goodwill is not they need to make money to pay their expenses they are not in this to provide low-cost goods to people who need it that's not their mission their mission is to put people to work and do job training which is also why i get irritated if your job is job training that woman is not going to be able to go work in any other retail establishment with that kind of an attitude, nor would the one who slapped me be able to go work in any other retail establishment with that kind of attitude. And they are supposed to be training these people to get out into the work world. There so. was no slapping today, though. She was slap free. She slapped me. She almost slapped somebody. <laughs> so it was going the opposite <laughs> way. But <laughs> That's kind of true. Yeah. All right. So, oh, got to calm down. Ooh, feel the love. Ooh, here's love. Feel the love. Yeah, <laughs> All right. But we did get some really good stuff. And I think I stayed pretty true you to my pretty good. $20. You did Only like, a few chocolates. I had to put some things back. I did mm -hmm. have to put something in it. Mm -hmm. And it, it pained me. It pained me a little bit. I know. But I'm very happy. I'm very happy. And you've seen the recap now. And you see how much that $200 is going to get turned into. So. I hope you can go out to your Goodwill and do the very same thing. Uh, until then, and as always, go be profitable and make it fun. And we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.